What's good ladies and gents, welcome to the MKO Pugilism Boxing Channel where we talk all things box. Remember to like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, put it on all so you can get notified of all the latest content on this channel as and when it drops. So without further ado, let's get into this. So just a quick little announcement, I'm sure many of you would have seen. Um, we're going to have in Abu Dhabi a good, good fight at um, light heavyweight, which is going to be between Dimitri Bivol uh, of Russia and um, Zudo Ramirez, Gilberto, aka Zudo Ramirez. And this is going to be, for me, a good entertaining scrap, I think, because Ramirez is a guy that... Um, you know, he's a big, big guy. Uh, he's been, he was decent at um, super middleweight. He's undefeated going into this. Um, he's, he's definitely, he's a guy that sort of, he's had a few little tests, but nothing really major, I'd say, at super middleweight. And again, at light heavyweight, obviously, an unknown quantity pretty much. But yeah, he looked devastating in his last performance. Um, and it wasn't really against anyone of no none of the, it wasn't against any of the big names at light heavyweight. So this is going to be a true test for him. Um, I think he's definitely got a chance in this fight. He's an aggressive guy. Um, he's he's got that uh, what they call the Mexican style, aggressive, come forward, not afraid to throw punches in bunches. And yeah, yeah, he's a guy that, that likes to put you away, you know what I mean? He's he's a he's a volume puncher and he's he's got a lot of grit, a lot of determination. And I think that although for me I, I have to uh, favour Dimitri Bivol, I fancy Dimitri Bivol to simply outbox uh, Gilberto Zurdo Ramirez um over twelve rounds. I expect um, you know, Bivol to sort of outbox him. But I think uh Ramirez, you know, Zudo is gonna cause um some problems to uh Dimitri Bivol. I don't think Dimitri Bivol is gonna be able to have it all his own way. Uh, this is a big guy. I mean I think looking at him face to face, um although uh Gilberto Ramirez has, has campaigned at the, the sort of lower weight limit, um you know Doing the, during the face-off is going to be in Abu Dhabi, um, Etihad Arena over there, and they were over there the other day doing their face-off and press conference and everything. Um, and Ramirez definitely looks like sort of the bigger guy. He looks like he, he towers over. It's not by that much per se, but he's definitely sort of taller and a bit bigger. Um, so I think he's going to be an imposing figure for Dimitri Bivol. He's going to be trouble. He's going to definitely at the very least cause him a lot of problems and give um uh Bivol a lot to think about when that fight takes place and yeah I for one I'm definitely looking forward to it and it looks like there's a good few bits and bobs coming up in boxing good few cards coming up so yeah let me know your thoughts about this fight I'm um, for one I'm happy to see this I like to see these sorts of fights um you know you're getting undefeated challenger against undefeated champion um, you know, things are moving well in, in the light heavyweight division. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm really looking forward to this one. Let me know what you think about this. Who do you think is going to win? Do you think um, Gilberto Zudo Ramirez? Do you think he could do much against Bivol? Or do you, like me, think he's, he's simply going to get sort of outboxed by Dimitri Bivol? Let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. And until next time, it's MKO Pugilism over and out.